The Lethbridge Police Service sent their recently drafted action plan off to Alberta's Justice Minister in the hopes that he won't dissolve the service altogether. Earlier this week, we reported the document was completed by LPS and the Police Commission ahead of Minister Casey Medu's April 16th deadline. Now, the plan was supposed to address several key areas of concern which have cast our police in a negative light. Jeanette Rocher has more on this story. Now, Jeanette, I guess the question is, will this new plan be enough to keep Minister Medu from taking some drastic measures on the LPS? Well, how the Justice Minister did give a strong warning that he could impose Section 30 of the Police Act, which means he potentially could dissolve the entire police service altogether if certain actions weren't met and certain concerns weren't addressed. Now, I did speak with the Police Commission Chair Rob Van Spronson today about this new action plan, and he remains fairly positive that it is a plan that does address much of the public concern including ethics and accountability, leadership development, employee mental health, communication, and database access. The biggest one, of course, is the ethics and the accountability piece, right? Because that's the piece that um, we feel is the most important. It's what led to the concerns in the first place, right? So dealing with ethics and accountability, making sure that there's a due process, uh, making sure that uh, there's those officers who do breach um, professional conduct are held accountable. Part of the um, of our of our action plan too is looking at that database, right? And the police database, the niche system. Just because those five people access it doesn't necessarily mean they did it inappropriately because the system isn't designed to 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 necessarily record a reason. And that's one of the re one of the things that we're going to change in that system is that when you log on to it, you have to give a reason for why you're in there. Now, according to Vance Bronson, that document was only sent off to the Justice Minister late last night. So we are still waiting to hear his reaction on that plan. Hal? Thanks so much, Jeanette. A summary of that action plan is available on our website and on our Facebook page.